Hello guys, what is up? Good morning. Today is Monday in the city of Abuja. No, I believe it's the same day, whatever you guys are watching this from as well. So guys, this is Aderonka as usual. So today is a busy day, but anyway, we are headed to our natural habitat. It's a mountain. We're going on a hike on the Monday morning. How exciting is that? Sorry, Moody. Are you feeling positive about this? Yes. All right, cool. You guys see that foggy situation over there? That's where we are trying to get to. So I hope it works. I hope it's fun. I hope we don't get lost because we've never been there before. But yeah, we'll see as it goes. So you guys should stick around. This should be an interesting one. All right. By the way, real estate development is really blowing up in the city of Abuja. But the irony is that most of these estates are really not affordable for the average class. So for the most part, they are going to go, you know, unoccupied for a long, long time, even after when they are completed. You haven't even gone 15 minutes into this hike and you're already panting. Are you sure you want to be a part of the workaholic brand? Because that's what we do. You are a workaholic brand. It's <laughs> only if I hate you together. <laughs> The funny thing about situations like this is that <clears throat> it feels like you're getting closer. I mean, you can see where it is that you're going through. I mean, you can feel it that the distance is getting longer and longer. I mean, you're walking and you're not getting there, but looking at it, it feels like you're getting closer. But you're actually walking and not getting there. It's a very tw twisted situation. Tricky. Tricky too. One more word. Tricky twisted. <laughs> Tricky twisted. Something <laughs> when you're going on a mission like this, all your mind and your body should be facing your mission like focus on your mission Dr. Khalid, yeah there's no point no i'm focusing on the mission right now that's what i'm doing the mission is to get to the mission what the Jesus. <laughs> i mean no no the, the mission is still ahead <laughs> and we are going see the mountain are you just here you're there already an apartment just here like a makeshift apartment like i said so we're just gonna ask the person it is like a pathway i hope you are not being intrusive intrusive here right oh yeah now. and we'll try i mean you're not <laughs> bad people now so let's go Thank you. So it turns out that there's a river ahead of us. So we have two choices. Either we try to cross the river or we try to take the longer route. But we met another very young chap who's willing to, you know, take us through his path. He's actually going to his farm, but I think from his farm we can connect to the mountain. And yeah, it's been an adventure. Actually, they prepare for this, but it's looking good. Okay, how do we do this? You say come again, say for the record. <laughs> yeah, this is my own worst fear. Um, guys, I'm not sure how exactly we're supposed to do this, but it looks like we have to do it some way, so we'll just try and do it, right? Uh, uh, it's that we're going to try and cross, you know, pull our shoes and go with our stuff. Then the camera would be here, and then I'll have to try and come back and get the camera. That's just crazy. That means I have to cross this place at least thrice. Yeah. Are you good? Filming with my phone because my camera is still there. 
and our very good friend here has offered to go help us speak. I actually wanted to go, but Ronka didn't want me to go. Apparently, she thinks it's too risky for me, even me that saved her life while crossing the river. But yeah, it's good that I'm not going, child. And my camera is coming to meet me. Kadang kadao. Mmm, Ngode. Thank you, Oka. So he actually was not even going away, he just actually helped us to cross the river. That was very gentlemanly of him. Quick update, it looks like we are getting closer to the foot of the mountain. And yeah, it's beginning to drizzle for a little bit, so we hope it doesn't rain. But if it rains, I believe it's part of the adventure, I guess. Although we have some umbrellas, so I hope that would help if it eventually rains. And yeah, we're still on the right path, I think. I wish I had a drone here. I think I should I should hang out more with my friends who fly drones. I mean, this would have been a perfect situation to fly a drone because the clouds are just covering all of the you know undulating hills around Abuja, even down to that area. It's just really mystic and dramatic right now. I think a drone shot would have been amazing. Guys, yeah, there's somebody's house just beneath the foot of this mountain, like a complete apartment. I could not film the front of it because I don't want to intrude on their privacy and there are like cameras around anyway. So yeah, but that's cool though. I will totally live like this. I'm not trying to be down now, I'm just stating the obvious. Let them know that you, I mean, you, you, you chickened out. But I was just kidding guys, um, the truth is that we are like in the middle of a farm. And there seems to be no way so if you have to pull through it means you'll be destroying some of the scrubs obviously and we don't want to do that so either we find another way around which i strongly believe we would that seems to be our only option because i ain't going back man i'm going but back. first i need a tea break and you put your lens again i'm blocking the light it's fine now that rain is falling i should leave water to touch my main lens oh yeah let's go back so this is like the fourth route we have tried taking to get to the foot of this mountain i kind of like see a small part do you think it will work i think it's blocked over there what's going on I mean, are you not surprised there are so many farms and we've not come across one farmer i mean it's not like i expect them to come every day but i mean they just I'm just expecting that with all of these farms which i can see one hope they would have even given us corn I'll oh, just give me the bag. I'm not eating. I don't want to do that. Okay. Thank you. Well, times like this, when we are disappointed and not knowing whether to go forth or back. Did you wash your hand? I don't need to. 19 gems. Something shall play, man. So it looks like this is where we are going to be stopping the hike for today because it looks like every place around this area is actually covered with farms and like I said we want to destroy this crop so we made it to the foot of the mountain actually the fog is just like above our heads right now but yeah, I know personally I'm going to be back though because I actually need to get up there. But I'm not sure if I don't care who is behind the camera right now and she's literally crying that she needs to go home. So, you know, I need to consider that, right? Dr. Kalis is a very big liar. The only reason why we did not go up was because he wants to risk his life to how many health hazards by entering inside bush. I don't even know if snake is there. Ah, stop blaming me. If you like, come back on your own. All right, that's, that's pretty fair. Yeah, true. No sense. So we're just gonna take some photos now and we'll be out of the I'll be out of here quick. Alright. Uh, we stop by this pond to so just take a break and chill for a little bit because you know man is tired and Ronka is not even helping. 
I swear, but if not for YouTube, I want to just cuss at you. I don't even understand. Why do you keep blaming me for your own tiredness? If you are tired, you are tired. Stop, stop, stop being a man on, on, on YouTube. Ah. <laughs> don't die. Stop being a man on YouTube, man. That was harsh. Wow. Speak. Khalid Moody and I said that we're going to come on this uh, small adventure to go to this big mountain. Me, I was just full of negativity because there was actually no path to follow through it. But then we tried the first time and I felt like, let's go, let's go there. The second day, I actually prayed that rain should have fallen to 12 o'clock because we moved it from yesterday because Omudi was not available to today. So that at least it should just discourage Khalid. But lo and behold, thank God to God, it did not happen. And we kept walking. First, I crossed river. Like, no, I was not able to cross for the first time. But I crossed before, but now I was able to cross it. We got to the mountain, but at least with my own negativity that obstructed the Khalid from going to the top. But only God knows what would have beaten him. And do you know how many pounds the human being weigh? I can't carry him. So I decided to take some shots and come back. And here we are. But I actually think that the more we push ourselves, the better we can become. Abi Khalid, what do you think? Uh, so my advice to everybody now, simple as we close this program for today. Is push yourself on one day at a time. The fear you won't get rid of the fear, but at least you know, you know you've tried your best. Mm-hmm.